Welcome. We're so excited that you are interested in our class and have come to find out more. Yeah, we're way excited to share uh, the things that we do in class because we think they're pretty neat, pretty innovative, pretty different, but uh, we're... We love it. Yep, we do. Now, as far as the class goes, we wanted to share with you very briefly some of the reason why we teach it the way that we do and how we actually teach it. For example, we are teaching English and history together. Yep, both of us are in the room at the same time. For both periods, uh, we both teach together, which is cool. I mean, how many times do you get two teachers in one room? And we find that the thing that makes it better when you have the two of us in there is that we are able to help you better find ways to share the grand sources of knowledge that are building in your head because that's really the main goal of our class. We have the assumption that you as a student care about your education and don't want to sit in a room with a teacher telling you what to do all the time, giving you worksheets that don't really matter and making you memorize facts that you don't care about. In fact, I've always liked to try to think of our classroom not so much as a classroom, but as a workshop where everybody mm -hmm. has things that they're working on. In fact, that's why you'll notice when you come into our classroom, there's no desks. Um, we have couches we like to sit around uh, like we're hanging out, learning and studying together. And this year, we'll be learning and studying some pretty awesome philosophies that will totally make your parents think that you're more smart than you ever have been before. Yep, it's our favorite class. It's our favorite class. The ancient world class. Um, well, in the ancient world stuff, we study Egyptian, Asian, Greek, uh, Middle East, all these things, and we read the original stuff, like the Book of the Dead, we read the Analects of Confucius, we read a lot of these ancient source documents that are really powerful, really profound, create lots of discussion, lots of ideas from the students. It's one of the most powerful sharing years that we have. And then we take those ideas and we connect them to the literature that we read, including books like To Kill a Mockingbird, which many of you may have read before, but have definitely not read it like you have in our class, because we compare Atticus Finch to Confucius. <laughs> We also spend some time with Huck Finn. We read The Lord of the Flies, 1984, a lot of books that will make you very angry, um, but will also make you think. <laughs> yeah. um, also, we like to uh, create kind of a culture and camaraderie with our class. We like to do lots of extracurricular activities. Um, many of these are optionals, but optionals, optional, but we like to go to plays. We like to go to concerts. Um, we take students down to Cedar City <clears throat> every year to go see the plays down mm -hmm. in at the Shakespeare Festival. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, we just feel that there's a lot of things that you learn that aren't just the classroom, lots of things to go out and yeah. see. The goal is to make education a part of your life, not just when you enter our door, but as you leave it as well, so that you just get this habit of thought that just goes everywhere that you do, which is great. Yeah. We basically want to turn you into nerds. <laughs> that is one of our but goals. cool nerds. <clears throat> That's true. Um, another aspect of our class is we do like to take good advantage of the blessings of technology the 21st century has afforded us. So our class has uh, is uh, fully uh, outfitted with iPads. We also have our very own computer lab. And we like to use this to help the students create and share their own ideas primarily. Um, a lot of our class has to do with sharing outside of the classroom. We don't because that's like... where the sharing really <clears throat> matters. Yeah, we don't like assignments that only matter in the grade book, that they're only doing it for points, because we feel that when you're doing it to share with people, or you're going to be on display, or what you do kind of matters, that you're going to put more of your effort into it. So we use these things to help students share on the website. They'll all constantly be writing for our website, creating videos. At the beginning of the year, we're going to do our very own Egyptian exhibit that the kids, that the students will make all of the aspects of that I'm super excited for. Um, but a lot of uh, sharing aspect that we're going to use the technology for to help the kids just create and like. And by explore. the kids, we mean you because we're talking to students right now, right? Sure, or their parents. Or their parents. <clears throat> Who's ever watching? Oh. That was really creepy. <laughs> I just wanted to see if I could see who was watching. Let's, don't do that again. <laughs> um, what else do we need to mention? Uh, joining our class? If you're interested, there's an application on the website. We ask you to fill out the application basically because the style of our class is a little different. Some students find it very liberating that they're able to pursue the activities they're interested in, and some students find it kind of stifling, especially if they're used to or accustomed to or prefer a teacher to tell them what to do all the time. So if you are a little bit of a rebel, um, or particularly creative, or just interested in trying something different, then fill out the application and email it to us, and we'll get you started. And we like to main sure, make sure to maintain that idea that uh, the students there want to learn and are excited and, cre and keep that culture up. We want to make sure we students We want our class to be that. a choice. Mm -hmm. Don't feel like you can't apply if your grade point is a little bit lower. That's not the difference. We don't, we're not worried about grade point. We're not worried about any special needs that you might have as a student. We're worried about your desire to be there and your excitement to yeah. learn. We want you to care. Yep. So if you care, and you're cool, and relatively good looking, then I think you should apply. I don't think that last one's a real requirement. She made that up. 
Um, so thank you for watching. Uh, I hope, uh, we hope that uh, we've answered some questions. Please feel free to contact us through this website. Um, we, our email is there. You can contact us on the contact form if you have any more questions or would like to know any more information about our class.